Thank you for choosing to upgrade your amalgam separator and join the Mars family of environmentally friendly dental practices. This short video will show you how to upgrade from your old amalgam separator to the best available technology in amalgam separation, the Mars Liberty Boss. Open the Liberty Boss box to find the Mars Amalgam Separator Upgrade Kit. Remove contents from the Liberty Boss box. Remove the stabilizing insert. Line the Liberty Boss box with the provided bag. The following tools are required. 5 16 nut driver, 7 16 nut driver, pipe saw, and duct tape. We begin to upgrade to a Liberty Boss by removing the old amalgam separator. If your old amalgam separator has been hard piped in, cut the inlet pipe a few inches from where it enters the mechanical room. Leave roughly 3 inch of pipe from the chair inlet. Turn on your suction pump to drain any excess water. Use your 516 nut driver to loosen the hose clamp on the rubber coupler attached to the old amalgam separator inlet. Lift the pipe out of the amalgam separator inlet. Your system should look similar to the following. Place supplied closeout plug on the inlet of the old amalgam separator. Tighten hose clamp on the rubber coupler securing the closeout plug. Similar to the process completed on the inlet, cut outlet pipe leading to the suction pump. Pull the amalgam separator away from the cut outlet pipe. Loosen hose clamp on rubber coupler and detach pipe. Insert supplied closeout plug. Tighten hose clamp on rubber coupler, securing closeout plug in place. Your system should look similar to the following. If you are upgrading from a filter type amalgam separator, bring out your duct tape to secure the filter to the upper chamber. Your system should look similar to the following. Use your 7 16 nut driver to remove your amalgam separator from the mounting plate. Your old system should look similar to this photo. Place the old amalgam separator into the plastic line box from step 4. Pull the bag over your old system and twist it to seal the bag. Zip the bag shut to create a watertight seal for transport. Place stabilizing insert over your old amalgam separator. Push the stabilizing insert into the box, tucking the access bag around your old amalgam separator down. Grab supplied box extension lid. Pull the Liberty Boss flaps up. Place extension lid over the top of the Liberty Boss box. Close the lid flaps. Tape the box closed, ensuring to tape the lid to the Liberty Boss box. This is to ensure the lid does not fall off during transport. Keep the old amalgam separator mounting plate to take to a metal recycling plant. The aluminum plate is worth money. If you are a technician, you can store the plates from all your amalgam separator upgrades and cash in on a substantial return. Mars has received $140 for 20 old amalgam separator plates. Place the Liberty Boss where you think it will best fit in the mechanical room. Thread part A of the Quick Connect into the outlet of the Liberty Boss. Thread part A of the Quick Connect into the inlet of the Liberty Boss. Your system should look similar to the following. For installations in a small space, a 90 degree elbow may be required. Thread the elbow into the inlet or outlet of the Liberty Boss, whichever side you feel your installation does not have the room for a straight connection into or out of the Liberty Boss. For the rest of these instructions, we are assuming we have no requirement for a 90 degree elbow. 
Prepare the inlet of the pump solids collector to thread the 1 inch Liberty Boss outlet hose. Current thread size on the 1 inch hose is a 3 quarter inch thread. If the inlet of the solids collector is 1 inch and not 3 quarter inch, add the supplied bushing to increase the thread's diameter. Thread the 1 inch hose into the inlet of the pump's solids collector. Be sure the arrow on the solids collector is pointing in the direction of airflow, towards the pump. Always have your solids collector located after your amalgam separator, never before. If a solids collector is located before an amalgam separator, it legally has to be disposed of as toxic waste, adding another cost to your amalgam separator costs. If it's located after your amalgam separator, it is considered sewer safe and you do not have to pay for its toxic disposal. Be sure to hand tighten. Do not over tighten as this could crack the plastic fittings. Connect part A and part B of the Quick Connects on the Liberty Boss outlet. Close the arms of part A of the outlet Quick Connect. Pull the locking pins off the rings on the Quick Connect arms. With the Quick Connect arms closed, slide the pins all the way through the channels locking the arms in place. Be sure the closure pin goes through both channels on either side of the arms. Connect Part A and Part B of the Quick Connects on the Liberty Boss Inlet. Part B is attached to the Liberty Boss Inlet hose. Lock the Quick Connect arms in place with pins, similar to the procedure for the Liberty Boss Outlet Quick Connect. Loosen the hose clamp on the rubber coupler attached to the inlet hose so it slides freely. Measure the length of hose required to reach the inlet pipe from chairs. This is the pipe that was cut in step 7. Use pipe saw to cut the inlet hose to the desired length. Your inlet hose should look similar to this photo. Slide the rubber coupler over the inlet pipe. Be sure to slide it in as far as it will go. Tighten the first hose clamp on the rubber coupler. Tighten the second hose clamp on the rubber coupler. Your inlet to the Liberty Boss should look similar to this photo. Turn on your suction and feel every new joint for suction loss. If there is a suction loss, re-tighten the fitting and test again. If there is no suction loss, you have now completed your Mars Liberty Boss Amalgam Separator Upgrade. Welcome to the Mars family of environmentally friendly dental practices. Be sure to fill out your warranty registration card entirely and email it to info at marsbiomed.com or you can fax it to 905-723-9610. Registering your Liberty Boss will A. Enroll your dental practice in the Find a Dentist app, a free advertising program. B. Enroll you in the Automatic Compliance Reminder program, letting you know when to change out your Liberty Boss. C. Supply you with a Certificate of Compliance, so if any of your local regulators were asking about your compliance, you can submit their certificate. And D, advise Mars of an old amalgam separator at your practice to be recycled. We will in turn send you information on how to get rid of your old amalgam separator. Thank you for choosing to be part of the Mars family of environmentally friendly dental practices. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact us at 1-866-594-3648. Alternatively, you can contact our very talented and well-trained distributors by finding their contact information on our distributor page at marsbiomed.com.